In this video, I'm going to talk about uh, another functionality within Power Toys tool application called as Always On Top. Now, Always On Top feature is used to pin the applications on top. Okay, now the shortcut is Windows Control T. Uh, you can basically format the appearance of the pin, pinned window. Now, as you see in the screenshot over here, I'm in my desktop, and in the desktop, if I want to pin Notepad, so if I open any other application, all this application will be opened behind this notepad and uh, notepad will take a preference and it will always show on top. Okay. Now you may need such kind of uh, behavior when you are referring to the pinned window. Okay. Example, if you want to have calculator open always, you know, and then if you're browsing through the net and if you want the calculator application opened uh, side by side, you can make use of this functionality and same goes with other application like if you want uh, your windows application to be opened side by side when you're browsing the web or you're doing some activity then those things can be achieved using always on top now let me show you a demo now how to trigger this is you need to go into uh, power toys you need to first install power toys and once you open power toys you have uh, this application always on top. Now remember, always on top is a quick and easy way to pin windows on top. So the shortcut is windows control T. We'll come to this setting in a while. First, let me show you one example. Okay, so let's assume I'm browsing the web. Okay, now while browsing, if I think that maybe I need calculator in front of me. Okay, so example, if I'm say seeing some scorecard, okay, for some game, okay and if i want to calculate some values then i need to have calculator handy okay now i'll open calculator now this is a calculator which i have okay now this calculator what i'm gonna do is uh maybe i'll just position this calculator in such a way that uh, i would like this calculator to be always open okay so now if i go into the web page the calculator disappears right so if i want this calculator to be present every time so i'll press the shortcut windows control p Okay, the moment I do that, now this calculator is like pinned on top. Okay, now I can see parallelly the scorecard. I can scroll this web page. Okay, still the calculator remains over here. And then, uh, you know, I can do some calculations. Okay, so maybe I'm just adding the scores of all the batsmen. Okay, so I, I can do this parallelly. Okay, and get my result. So this is just one example. Now, if you want the spin windows color to be in a different format you can do that okay now it's showing green border right you, if you want red color you can do that in the settings plus uh, if you want to get out of it again press the same keyboard shortcut windows control T. okay the moment to do that you are out of it now let us navigate to the setting now if you see here appearance and behavior now it's on show a border around the print window and now if you change the color over here from green to say uh, say yellow okay or maybe let me select this lime color or say dark yellow okay and out of this yeah if this is the one you want then yes again if you go into this thing and if you press windows control v now you see the color has changed okay so that's how you change the color of the border around the print window you can also set the opacity thickness uh, and color mode okay whether you want a custom color or a windows default color now sound you can also play sound when pinning a window now remember there is another section called as excluded app now this shortcut will work for everything but if you want some apps to not to show over here then you can type in over here the application name in some format okay now take for example if you have a notepad okay now you want to uh, imagine you want to have a notepad open side by side then what you need to do is again you need to type in the keyboard shortcut windows control p and notepad will be pinned okay on top but what if you want this behavior to be taken off from notepad again coming back into the power toys tool application if you type in the application name and you say okay let me um, let this shortcut not work for notepad okay then you can put the excluded app over here and then when you go into the web page and now if you click windows control t 
nothing happens. So I'm pressing Windows Control D, nothing is happening because Notepad.exe application is excluded from using always on top application. Okay, so that's it, folks. This is all about always on top. It's a quick and easy way to pin Windows on top. Thanks for watching.